guys, I'm Noah from Tata Soul Studio and today I want to show you a few ways to do a photo shoot for your products if you need a nursery or a kids room but you don't have kids and you don't have babies and you need to create a little scene of a kids area or... I'm going to show you a few tips and tricks to how to get the best photo you can get at home by yourself. I'm doing the um, photography for all the things in my business, uh, for my Etsy shop, for this YouTube channel, for my Instagram, for my blog. Uh, you can check out my work all around. I will leave links below and let's get started. So this is my bedroom. I moved the bed to the side so I would have more space. And these are all the things I'm going to shoot today. So I'm going to show you my first setup. Ta -da -da -da! I've used a small rug and a small bins and a small side table. And the tip is make a small setup so everything could fit in your frame. And for accessories, you can use a lamp, plants, or just decorative things you have in different rooms and will look really together in this um, setup. I'm using now the same spot but with different rug and different side uh, table and I want to mention how important natural light is. Don't forget to use the natural light in your home. If you have a good spot, just use it all the time. I'm using a different spot now and just so you know, any clean drawer will do. Use what you have, anything will be good on white. Use your sofa, everybody has a sofa in their home and it will make them easier to imagine your product on their sofa. Okay, so this is my favorite cheat. You can use benches or chairs or even the edge of your own bed to create kids bed or crib. Just take close up shots and no one will know. So I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to check out more videos and if you want me to do more videos about photography or um, business tools and ideas, I don't know, let me know in the comments. See you guys next time, bye!